I'm excited because something arrived today. Yeah. Although clearly my boob is too big that I have to kind of rotate to see the whole quote. But yes, I love this quote because it doesn't just apply to fitness, it can apply to anything. So if you want something similar to this, go and I'll put the link below. It's uh, Jess's, well, Truly Jess, so you know I follow. Um, she um, has a shop basically, she's got a Canadian one, which I don't know, I think that ships to the US as well, or you've got a UK based one as well, I'll put both the links down below. And then you can, um, if you want one similar, then feel free. But she also currently has a giveaway on it, um, depending on obviously when you watch this, whether it's still going, but yes, um, I'll put her link to that video down as well, just in case you want to join in. So yeah, I just, isn't she awesome? Ooh. Oh. So now I'm gonna go and turbo fire. I almost didn't because I've been trying, I've, um, last night I caught up on a lot of sleep, but I was like, mm, do I just not? But I was like, no, 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 I'll have my sleep now. I'll go and do my fire 45, so now I'm gonna do that. Um, so I will see you later, yay. Mm -mm. Dinner on a Sunday afternoon is uh, roast turkey breast, um, uh, red onion, red pepper, green pepper, and some noodles in a black bean sauce. Mm -mm. Good morning, guys. It is Monday. Uh, I woke up really, really hungry this morning. Like, my tummy is like. So, um, I'm going to do my turbo fire. It's the 555 Easy, one of my favourites. Yeah. And then I'm going to get some breakfast. Whoop. Okay, breakfast this morning, bit random, but it's just what I wanted. It's just a um, two egg, just plain omelette and some avocado, half an avocado. So I've just been watching Healthy Sam's um, vlog, her um, YouTube video, go and check her out. Um, and she was saying how disappointed she was from um, just not, you know, like eating chocolate or, you know, she didn't feel like she was sort of trying hard enough. Believe me, I've been there. If you go and watch my earlier videos, even like the last video I uploaded where it was a week that just didn't go right at all and you know no matter how many people are sort of like oh yeah yeah I'm doing really well really well there are going to be days or even weeks where people would just have a total fail moment and just regret all the decisions they've made whether it's for the whole day or even if it's just like one meal people can end up beating themselves up about it and I think the one thing is to just not feel so bad about it yeah you can sort of appreciate the fact that right I, I shouldn't have done that but you just need to learn from it and um and, and not uh, my mistake was beating myself up about it all the time when really life is going to get in the way you know you're going to go to places and or go for a meal and it's not going to have a healthy option or it's you know life isn't perfect it's not always like walking into a health store every day so you have to kind of roll with the punches and it's it's not going to stop you from getting to your goal. It's it's just something you have to over overcome and and just push through the next day. So hopefully you will feel less kind of um, about it. But um, yeah, just keep at it and it goes to everyone as well. Just keep going. It's not an easy journey. Otherwise, everyone would be doing it. You know, it's only the winners that keep going. So we're winners, yeah. <laughs> right, I'm gonna have my omelette and then go to work. See you later. Uh, for lunch I had leftovers from last night, so that turkey stir fry thing. Um, so dinner tonight, I will most likely, because it's Austin Monday today, so I will be changing my plan so I tend to have something quick and simple. It may end up being a Weight Watchers, Weight Watchers microwave meal. So I could have an ocean pie. Ooh, or oh, there's a sweet and sour chicken. There is a beef hot pot as well. I don't know, I'm kind of in the sweet and sour mood. Sweet and sour is 317 calories, the beef hot pot's 231 calories, and the ocean pie is only 196 calories. I've had a pretty good day, so I can afford a little bit of extra calories, so I might as well make the most of the extra calories I have and have the sweet and sour chicken. Hey. <coughs> so my voice just went, I'm just. Um, I just went to the shop. See, in my old former life, I would have like literally got in the car, and it would have taken like minutes to get there. But it's like just a ten minute walk there, and then ten minute back. Not even that. Probably about five minutes. Some actual porridge oats, just plain oats, 
hardly any sugar, a little bit of fat, but you know, I, I assume that's just like natural fat. But it's pretty much ingredients, I think, are just like oats. Yeah, 100% oats. So I'm going to try this because I've never tried plain oats before. I've, obviously, you've seen me have my um, my Quaker oats, like the flavoured things, but never have had the plain ones. So I'm going to give it a go. I'm curious, and I know I probably shouldn't have, but I want to try it. I've never tried peanut butter before, so I'm going to try something. And similarly with those cravings, Nutella chocolate spread because. Sometimes you just need it. <laughs> so this is for like emergency situations. So instead of me like eating ridiculous amounts of actual chocolate, just a spoonful of that should help. I think for this, a 15 gram portion is 81 calories and the peanut butter, a 15 gram portion is 92 calories. So actually Nutella is probably a little bit better. And then milk, the local shop only has uh, semi skimmed milk. I usually go for skimmed, but I've just gone for a, uh, we can't actually see semi skimmed instead so it's not like it's whole milk so it's not really going to make a difference and it's only really for my tea so I'll just account for that when I put it all in my fitness pal I'll just add a bit more because I always put in my tea because I have milk so if I put in just slightly a bit more like as if I've had more cups then it should account for the fact that it's semi skimmed not skimmed I almost ran out of breath there sorry so I'm going to unpack and then I will probably finish for the day so I will see you tomorrow Morning guys, it's Tuesday, it is freezing, I don't know, it, like yesterday it was quite nice, quite mild, and I woke up this morning and I looked briefly out the window, and I had to do a double take and I was like, that car is frozen, I'm like, how, how, why, oh, so I was absolutely freezing when I woke up, but um, yeah, I'm sure Turbo Fire will warm me up. Hey, so just had a shower. I have got a towel on. <laughs> don't, don't panic. Um, but I just did my body fat percentage because um, you have to have wet feet in order to do it. So I thought oh, I'll just do it after the shower. And it came up as 27.5% body fat, which I'm still surprised at. I'm like, I don't believe it. I don't trust it at all. So that's apparently what it is. So I'm just going to go with it. So hopefully I can improve on that. We'll see. Hello. So I've just tried my first attempt at um, proper oats, not like the uh, sachets that I usually use, but proper, like from scratch oats. Um, and I've tried it, and it's it's very different to the sachets. It does taste different. It tastes nice. I made it with milk, but actually, I think tomorrow or the next time I do it, I think I'm going to use water because it's really creamy, which is nice. But it feel I think it'd be quite heavy, so I'll give it a go and see if I sort of finish the whole thing because it's like it looks really like thick and. Lovely. Oh. So yeah, but I don't know. I'll I'll give it a go. I've I've had it plain because I think quite I quite like the taste on its own. But I'll try it with milk. Um, no, I'll try it with water next time and see if I still like it. So I've just finished my porridge. I think milk was a bit heavy, so it did feel I'm so full right now. And yeah, I kind of felt like I was forcing it down, but I still finished it all. So that will definitely keep me going till lunch. But one thing I've just totally remembered as I was flicking through YouTube, as I do when I'm, watching, uh, when I'm eating breakfast, is um, overnight oats. I totally forgot that I could do that. And it's so much quicker and I could just get it out of the fridge. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to experiment with a couple of recipes and see what my favourite combination is. But I'm pretty much thinking something chocolatey. But, um, oh, I don't know, maybe something strawberry-ish. Maybe. But yeah, so I'm going to do an overnight oats at some point and then obviously try the next morning and show you and hopefully it'll be very nice. So woo, I'm very excited. Hello, so I'm cooking dinner. I've uh, got the, you may have seen it before in one of my other videos, it's the um, Tesco. I think I've got, oh I'm still holding my, yeah. Um, the, Tesco Simply Bake Cod Fillets with Tomato and Basil Butter Sauce. Um, it's 170 calories, 8.1 grams of fat, um, but it's so yummy, it's unreal, and it's dead easy. You just put it in the oven and it's like done. So I'm going to do that with some veg, probably brock. Um, I might do one of the. Just hold on. 
Uh, I'm gonna have one of these um, single steamers. It's broccoli, cauliflower, and sliced carrot, um, just with my fish. So that will be lovely. And um, I'm also gonna be prepping some overnight oats. So I'm gonna do I'm gonna do two in case one is horrible. I'm gonna try a strawberry one and a chocolate one. So I will <laughs> I'll see how they go. If I have to chuck them, then I will chuck them. But yeah, mm, dinner is served. It looks a bit messy, but that's just because I literally just chucked it on a plate. But I'm so going to enjoy this one. Okay, so I've just started preparing, well, I've pretty much prepared now my um, overnight oats. I've done two. Um, I may end up having one for breakfast and then one at the end of the day. I don't know yet. But basically, I use my half a cup measuring thing and I put um, half a cup of oats in each bowl. In that one, I put the whey protein strawberry um, and just one scoop of that and then half a cup of semi skim milk and in that one the chocolatey one I put the chocolate flavour and I also put a bit of cinnamon in as well so they I'm so excited about these I could cry so tomorrow I will see how they turn out Good morning, uh, it is Wednesday, it's rest day today, so, um, and this is the day that I go to the other office, so um, I'm doing several things at once. I'm prepping today's lunch, because I forgot to do it last night, so I'm just doing that now, but while that's going, my overnight oats. So, here we go. I've gone for the strawberry one. Ooh. Oh, it smells amazing. Okay, I'm gonna try some for the first time. I'm kinda nervous. I have a new favorite breakfast ever. I'm gonna so eat this all, like right now. And I can't wait to try the chocolate one, either later or tomorrow, I don't know yet. Oh, so good. Seriously, I could cry from how nice those oats were. <laughs> I'm really feeling really pleased. So um, I had those, I prepped my lunch, I've got this pasta. I think that'll do me for lunch. And I've also got a snack of my um, cinnamon apple, wait, apples covered with cinnamon. Mm. So uh, that'll keep me going during the afternoon. Or maybe as like a dessert after lunch, I don't know. I'm cold. You will be proud of me, people, because I had a really bad day at work, really stressful. And for dinner, I was like, I got in and I was just like, I really don't, I want to eat junk. I want to eat absolute junk. So I looked in the cupboard and I saw a tin of tuna and I was like, I haven't had tuna for a long time. So I ended up having a tuna, oh, what was it? Tuna with a bit of mayo, like extra light mayo um, made up. So it was like a tuna mayonnaise. And then I had two rivita of um, two Rivita crisp bread things and a salad with a little bit of um, extra virgin olive oil and uh, balsamic vinegar um, and actually it was really really nice I really enjoyed it so I'm so pleased that I went for a healthy option even though I really wanted to eat total total junk Good morning, it is Thursday. I did Fire 30 and Tone 30 this morning. So now I'm having my chocolate protein, no, chocolate overnight oats. Yeah, chocolate overnight oats. Well, I guess they're protein-ish because they're all protein powder. It's chocolate and cinnamon. <laughs> so I'm gonna try this. Hopefully it, it tastes as good as it smells and I will see you later. Wow, those oats are awesome.